Hello, my name is Mike Driscoll, and today we are going to continue Python's built-in function series by talking about the aiter and anext uh, functions. So what is aiter anyway? You know, I don't even know how to pronounce this, I'm just kind of making it up as I go, but I, I believe it's uh, aiter or asyncitor for the uh, iterator method. So what it does is it returns an asynchronous iterator for an asynchronous iterable. It's equivalent to calling um, x.aiter. Note, unlike um, the iter function, aiter has no two argument variant. This is something new that was added in Python 3.10. What about a next? Uh, when awaited, the a next module will return the next item from the given asynchronous iterator or default if given and the iterator is ex exhausted. This is the async variant of the next built-in and behaves similarly. What this does is it calls the anex method of async iterator, returning an awaitable. Awaiting this returns the next value of the iterator. If the default is given, it is returned if the iterator is exhausted. Otherwise, stop async iteration is raised. So how do you use aiter or anext? Well, technically, you usually don't. Um, the way you're supposed to use it, if you go to like Stack Overflow, it'll kind of explain. And it says that normally, you know, your object will have the dunder aiter and the dunder anext methods defined, and so they'll take care of it for you automatically. You won't need to do it yourself. Now you can write it yourself if you really, really need to, if you need to explicitly call it. Um, you can do, you know, some variable name equals aiter and then pass it the iterable that's asynchronous and then await on it or asynchronously loop over it. But for the most part, you actually won't be using that. Um, I found this website called itsourcecode.com. It has several examples of using it directly, but for the most part, nobody actually does this. I'm not even sure these are good examples. So for, or, you know, overall, just use the dunder methods or the magic methods. That's probably the way to go. I hope you found this uh, video helpful, and I hope to see you next time, too.